One of the most common types of romance novels is about the reformed rake, a devilish man whore who sleeps with anything that moves until he meets the one right girl who makes him hang up his man parts to settle down for a long, one lady life. She usually ends up pregnant in the epilogue. Thank God I called it off with Fox before that. Now, I just have to make up a good story to tell the guild about our equitable parting, and I can close the book on the whole thing. Meanwhile, I'm filming that commercial with Blades tonight, so I have to learn how to make a film in 11 hours. I just looked at my wrist, and I'm not wearing a watch. <laughs> so dumb. Yeah, pregnant gamer tees are a great idea. I don't know why people wouldn't be into them. We went to like four game stores wearing prototypes and people thought we were a reality show prank. Except one guy who wanted us to pose for his weird fetish website. Dare I ask? Making it with babymakers.com. Oh, nice website. Hey, what's up with Vork? He created a password protected channel and he's been in there with strangers all day. Vork, Torgothian average channel? What do you advise about Wardweed? Invest! Uh, I need Wardweed, 50 gold. Do you Wardweed at 50 gold? But Sal Silva, I believe Player Gankmaster is planning on flooding the market. He's a miner, correct? Correct. Got silver for 100 gold. Got silver for 100 gold. I have to say, Mrs. Zabu. Avinashi. I'll never remember that. This is brilliant. By creating a derivatives market of the Togothian economy, we've added an intriguing new level of gameplay that'll net me a tidy sum with each trade. That sounds complicated and scammy. It's a free market to work. Your mother's a brilliant woman. Oh, it's my pleasure to help in any way, Mr. Vork. Gherkins? Hold on a minute, woman. I don't know where your fingers have been. Mm. Tolerable. What's up, ladies? Oh, nothing. Just trying to learn filmmaking in 24 hours. Things are going awesome here. My mom is so focused on Vork that she's totally ignoring me. <laughs> mom! Gherkin! <laughs> Man, she always feeds me when I dolphinize. This is great. I really want a Gherkin now, though. And life is perfect. Zabu, your mom and Vork hooked up? What's in the water lately? No, 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 never that. They're working together on the Guild Hall. See, Vork's got this awesome plan laid out. What happens in Shed stays in Shed. I'm not worried. We're up to 300k in savings. What? But you've been offline all day. How are you keeping up the pace of your earnings potential? Well, Tink and I have a secret weapon. <laughs> Blake and Gabby, keep collecting cotton for Auntie Tink. Kill the monsters. Get monsters. Boys are stupid. Boys are stupid. <laughs> These kids are growing on me. The sea festival's almost over, but by that time, Tink and me will be serving tea to the guild in a bitchin' fairy palace. <laughs> I was visualizing custom gargoyles with my face superimposed, but that dream is slipping from my grasp. Oh, keep trading. The plan will work. Miss Sabo, I don't... Do not resist, Mr. Work. You are deserving of pampering. I cleaned out your kitchen earlier. I threw out many expired large cans of food. You what? Keep your hands off my chow! Oh my god. Venom just sent me a picture of Fox with some chick in a giant panda suit. Check out Fox's date last night. Oh, how creepy. It's so gross. Wait. Last night? What? What a man scheme! That jerk face is cheating on Codex? <laughs> she wishes. So Codex, how's everything going with Fox? Um, sad news. Uh, we decided to break it off this morning over brunch. Prosciutto omelets to be precise. What? Really? Yeah, it was a mutual decision. Let's not talk about it anymore. Codex, you're a total liar! What are you talking about? Why? Venom just texted me and told me that Fox has been going out with girls all week. You guys were never dating. You're just a one night stand. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that almost made me poop a little. Oh, it's back in. Turtle-headed. Codex, you're so wily. Like that coyote, what's his thingy? Okay, fine, Tink, you're right. I was lying the whole time. I am a ho diddy ho bag. But I only did it because I, I, I cared about what you guys think about me. And now you've made me feel worse than I already did before. So, thanks a lot. I'm gonna go home and just eat a lot of calories. I hate it when I'm right. Wait, no I don't. Tink! Schadenfreude. Gesundheit. I was able to run down the garbage truck, but I could salvage no green beans. This is a disaster! Vork, Codex was lying about her and Fox the whole time. And I don't feel happy about it. I just feel bad for Codex. I'm a good friend! Yes! Woohoo! Very supportive. Get these shoulders ready, because she's going to cry on them. <laughs> Here I come, Codex! Go get them. And you, 
Expiration dates are mere suggestions, like late fees and traffic lights. If I think too hard about what's going on right now, I might be a little creeped out, but I actually appreciate you coming over. No problem. God, this mask is tightening up over my face. Man, I never put this on another part of my body. Well, maybe. Why did I think lying to the guild was a good idea? Why did I hook up with that guy at all? Don't kick yourself. He's got some great equipment. How do you know? I inspected him on the server. Boot to Helm. Oh, yeah, right. His character's armor is very sexy. <laughs> totally. Uh, I gotta get back to Cheesy Beards, film that stupid commercial. Work is a solace of sorrow, right? <laughs> oh god, that was a quote. I knew it! You're not over him. Well, everything is happening just as I imagined. But don't worry, best friend. I prepared for this. Fox! It takes one to forgive, two to reconcile. Generic greeting card. He's good. What are you doing here? I wanted to see how this scene played out. See? The sidekick always reunites the heroine with the hero. Not if the heroine thinks the hero is a total tool bag. But I was just trying to get rid of the Moby montage part of your sadness. Well, yet again, your attempts are totally well-intentioned, but overboard and inappropriate. Are you sure that you're over me? And you! Stop trolling me in real life! Bye, Fox. Oh. Oh. shoes. I got it from this guy who does van art. The likenesses are pretty special.